This is Luis J Gomez going back and forth with some guy on Twitter. I'm not too sure what this what this guy's deal is. There's a user here called like Eggy who's got Luke Thomas's picture as his avatar, who has been trolling fucking Air, you know Luis J Gomez for fucking Luis. I said Luis J. How do you fucking pronounce his name? Um, L J J L J G or Gomez? Let's call him Gomez. Who's been fucking trolling Gomez for fucking what the best part of a few hours? And in the process of trolling Gomez, he then decides to troll him about Brendan. And Gomez basically makes it very clear that him and Brendan are friends now. So this is a real big um, turn of events actually happening in real time where we're seeing um, Gomez doing what he does best. You know, go after and insult people in L.A., stand up comedians basically about how they live and what they do. But then really and truly deep down, he actually just wants to be part of the cool guys club. He's just pissed off that he's never really been part of it. There are some New York guys that feel like you do their own thing, which is all good. And they don't really care about the LA scene. But there's also some dudes who it's quite clear that because they were never part of it, they just insult it because they know they're never going to be friends with Rogan. They're never going to get on Rogan. They're never going to be part of that cool club, especially now that they're all gone to Austin. I think that's part and parcel of it. Because if you look and you scroll up, you see him going back and forth with this guy. This guy says to him, he just wants to be famous. There's a reason why he wanted Rogan somebody to like him. Um, Gomez replies, LOL, I just want to be famous. So that's why I keep saying fucked up shit on camera, stupid bitch. The guy replies back to him and says, um, no, he replies back to him and says, look at this dumb bitch of a man who has another man whose profile is a picture. If you see men like this, smack them in their fucking pussy faces. Another one. Um, the guy says someone got someone jimmy's got rustled i guess i hit a nerve gomez replies back and says i'm on a flight f word what's your excuse for using another man's face as a profile picture i love this as a, i love this as like a way to kind of clap back at people i'm on a flight i'm just on the shitter and stuff like if you're replying you're replying there's no way to kind of make yourself look cooler because you happen to be on a flight that's why you're replying it's, i mean it's not doesn't work that way Another one says, the guy says to him, what? Get mad, Luis. It's the only time you're funny. Keep watching, bitch. That was quite good, actually, to be fair. It was quite a little good burn. Um, another one. I'm hoping he is. He's hilarious. If he's actually got mad at telling me his truth, all he, is, all he has as a comeback is why he isn't my proper picture, blah, blah. Um, right, let me see what he said about it. Yeah, there we go. Here, there's a Brendan bit. So the guy says to him, you're a lame ass social media influencer that is trying to be funny and that's all you got the basics come on bruh i gotta be honest sure might be funnier than you and he is a worse uh, he's he's the worst b at least he says at least what he says is unintentionally funny <laughs> and then lewis replies back to him and says referencing brendan Schaub, look at where you look at look at where you are in life b enjoying the fight in the kids subreddit it's all you have truly sad lol you made your profile picture luke thomas because he's the manager at pf chang's what an actual loser so it looks like lucia gomez is in in a way to get back at this guy he's also slightly insulting my fucking home the you know pf chang's and making it known that he thinks those guys are losers because clearly brendan's gonna be at fucking legion of skanks in what it's september and shit so clearly they've been a little bit more pally pally they're probably talking on the phone a lot more and lewis is doing what he always does he talks a big game about these la guys and then when he's confronted with them face to face he cowers and just tries to be their friends because deep down that's what he always wanted to be he wanted to be part of the core club he never was invited and you know and he's basically trolling of these guys the same way they're trying to keep people do was just a way for him to kind of get their attention in a mind about shape or form or to basically vent you know for not being invited uh yeah it's just they're going back and forth for ages to be honest it feels like hours i've just scrolled up on his profile but as you can see they just keep going back and forth back and forth it's kind of lame but the name of the fucking game is this tweet over here where essentially it feels like lewis j gomez is making it very known that him and brendan are cool now you know they are friends that's why he's making it kind of known here in this post that you got up there. So I guess the whole arc of Lewis kind of sticking it to the man and fighting against the LA comedic stand-up industrial complex is completely gone. You know, that shit has completely gone.